Okay, so here we are at a coffee stand in Mount Evelyn in Australia, beautiful gum trees, wonderful setting. This little coffee shop starts serving people from five o'clock in the morning. There's a queue here a mile long from five o'clock in the morning and Brian serves the most beautiful coffee from this amazing coffee and from here we collect the coffee and we take it and we process it with wood chips and we make it into an additive to put into your coffee into your compost bin. And the beauty of uh, coffee grounds is that they produce nitrogen in the soil and they're a replacement for things like chicken manure, like organic growers use chicken manure, but often you don't know what's in the chicken manure, whereas with coffee, it's just coffee. But it's a, got a lot of trace elements and a lot of nutrients. And in fact, there's more nutrients in the coffee grounds that you throw away than there is in the coffee you drink. So it's a great thing to do, and it saves millions of tonnes of coffee going to landfill. In Australia alone, one, one chain of uh, coffee stores, 10,000 uh, tonnes of coffee going to landfill a year. That's a lot of methane. And if you take every coffee drinker in Australia, that's hundreds of thousands of tonnes. So we could absorb the whole lot and put it back into our garden. Cappuccino. Yep. Beautiful. Thank cappuccino you. Cappuccino for Tim. Thank you. Here are Tim, best cappuccino in the southern hemisphere. Yeah. <laughs> it's absolutely beautiful coffee. He has a roaring trade here. And we pick up probably 20 kilos of coffee grounds a day somewhere in that order, and we take eggshells as well because eggshells are wonderful for the garden. So the biofuel cell is about utilising every bit of resource. And if you take all the shops to collectively in Australia, it's hundreds of thousands of tonnes of coffee scraps. Now the beauty of it is that normally uh, organic growers use chicken manure, and the problem with that is you don't know what's in it. But with coffee grounds, it's a beautiful clean material, and it's a high nitrogen material for your garden. So it gives you a lot of the leaf growth and all of that part of, that you need in your growth of your garden. Thanks, Brian, that's fantastic. Okay, amazing coffee. Uh, amazing coffee. And the beauty of this coffee is that it's great to drink, but it's even great to keep the coffee grounds because there's more in the coffee grounds even than what there is in the coffee. So if you have a cabbage later on that's been grown from the coffee grounds, you're getting all the extra goodness that was stored in the coffee grounds. easier.